Well, hello guys. So this is the island of Molokai, the island that I grew up on and we call home here in Hawaii, or Hawaii, as we are supposed to call it. Most people know of Hawaii as Hawaii, but actually the Hawaiian language, W is usually V, V, so Hawaii or Molokai. So um, that's how it's usually pronounced by the local people. And I just want to say that this island is is an amazing place so let's just look around a little bit here i want to show you the grass so this is the island we're up at about 275 feet so you look down to the ocean there do you see any houses here of course not no but down at the bottom there there's a few houses a little settlement here a couple of churches when i was four years old vacation bible school was down there in that grassy area you can see a couple Filipino people out there fishing, collecting crabs. This reef line, the waves break out about, in some areas, about a mile. About 5,000 feet or so, it's quite a ways out. Uh, half a mile, quarter mile, it gets closer here as you get to the east end. And this is the only house on the hillside in this entire area. So you can see that there are no other houses around here. This property goes clear down to the road. So these other little sheds um, are little cottages and um, all on this same property. But this is the main house and uh, it is beautiful. You can see a couple of whales out there right now. Maui is about eight miles away. That's Maui there, Lahaina right here. Um, right around the corner on this side is uh, main uh, town and shopping centers and shopping malls and stuff like that are over there. Um, Kahalui Airport. We call the airport here Molokai Hoalehua. And this is Lanai or Lanai. The little island there in the distance is Koholavi. And a uh, little horseshoe island which is called Molokini. And uh, so it's just a beautiful place. And I'm 47, so this is 2017. So Captain Dan is going to come visit us over here, and I'm trying to tell him. So right over here, see this, Captain Dan? See this nice big little channel and big harbor right here? The waves break quite far in, so you can actually uh, anchor the boat right there. This is quite a nice little area, easy to to swim in or take a little dinghy in, no problem. And this right here, right down below us, is a little channel there that is is there. You could actually moor, but I would suggest just go down a little bit farther right there. Better spot, better location. There's a couple, couple nice little places. We used to bring a boat in there and right in there and uh, anchor it and sleep and then head to Maui in the next early morning okay so this is hawaii and this is molokai and this is a very very peaceful life very quiet life you hear birds the wind is usually a nice breeze up here sometimes it blows trade winds from right in through here that's right out to the pacific ocean big island is over here you cannot see the big island from here if you're down that side you can actually see part of the big island on a clear day and uh, we've got some boxes here we need to ship to the Philippines because we are extremely involved in the Philippine mission of our church. And we need to ship some boxes. It's about $90. We've got four boxes. But you know what? I don't think I'm going to be able to ship them all. Maybe I'll be able to ship one of them. And the rest, we're going to have to... They're just going to get lost or stolen or be left here for looters and vandals to go through. And it's really uh, sad that people steal and they don't respect you know, others things but that's how it is in life There's not enough people to, to uh in life that we can find to be able to watch over things that are trustworthy it's really sad the people that we think we can trust are the ones that are watching our things usually those are the ones that steal everything you know jesus is coming soon and uh all of our all of our sins are going to be gone over, and I, you know, 
most Christians believe once saved, always saved. Give your heart to Jesus. Doesn't matter what you do. But I tell you, if you guys are wrong that believe that, you've got to miss. You're going to miss out on a lot. Heaven, being with Jesus. You know, I want to prove to God that I love Him. The Bible says, "If you love me, keep my commandments." One of the commandments is, "Thou shalt not steal." And so I want to prove to him that I love him by keeping his commandments because he says, if you love me, keep my commandments. And that's what I want to do. And I would encourage others to do the same. Okay, so hope you enjoy this little video vlog here. This is 2017. And just take a look at that. Look at this. Can you imagine? Inside the house is beautiful. You look out the windows, little deck out, breeze. And you just look at this all day long. What do you think, guys? Tell me what you think. Send me your comments. It's warm all the time, 75 degrees, summer and winter, beautiful sunrises, birds make noise, you hear them in the background. And you know, this is like this here, but every one of these valleys is incredible. We just got a bunch of bananas down here, up this valley right around the corner, Wailua Valley. And then Halava is just around the corner here, Halava Valley.